Maximum the Hormone. Two, is this off of maybe their second album? Oh, wow. So all of this... Okay, so awaited second brand new music video. Maximum the Hormone 2. Let's talk about Mankata Kotali. This was released on MTH official YouTube channel. Maximum the Ryokun was di diagnosed as complication of lifestyle related diseases and warned that he was going to die if he wouldn't change his lifestyle by a medical doctor. So Maximum the Ryokun Hormone Ryokun started a diet and exercise, lost weight and got well. This is obviously just probably Google translated. So I think we're just going to listen to the song. Not worry about the description, dude. Thank you so much, Dragonfly. Let's jump on in to the track with the video. He did lose a lot of weight in the song. Oh. Cool. Well, good for him. You yeah. know, hope he did it healthily. Dude, it's been so long since we listened to Maximum Hormone. Since I. Japanese. Hold on, dude. What? Dude, I thought... I thought we were getting wholesome for a second, but then... <laughs> Music and words. God, I have to pause it real quick. Holy shit, they are just doing so much. Wow, uh, reminiscent of like System of a Down, just random, seemingly random, just uh, time signature, change-ups, bouts of silence. Dude, it's, it's all over the place. Just silence and then chaos. Dude, just explosions of energy. This is, they've like evolved in a, great way when was this like four years ago i said <laughs> let's get back into it Yeah, 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 yeah
dude. <laughs> dude, this switch up is so funny, dude. Uh, this is kind of their shtick, right? If you go back and listen to Coin Omega Lover, I don't even know if you can actually find that track anymore. I've had trouble finding that track lately on YouTube. You can probably find like their updated version, but uh, I think that's kind of what they're trying to do. They're just try maybe did the redone version kick the old one in the trash? I don't know. Uh, but they go from like really heavy to like a dancey, maybe poppy. Uh, this is this is. This is fun, right up their alley. And also, this is their drummer, too. I'm aware this is their drummer. She she comes in and starts singing at some points. Uh, but she's also on drums, dude. Somehow you like this. Is this Bow Wow Wow? It's not Bow Wow Wow. I don't know what Bow Wow Wow is. Somehow you like this? I'm glad you like it, Gerard. <laughs> buy their hats dude oh maximum the hormone bros right thank you i missed that of course <laughs> i was like math bros i want to play that game <laughs> but wow this was maximum dude i don't even know what song this was What what is the name of this song do we have to should we translate this title Translate selection to English. Uh, Japanese. Hold on, I can do this real quick. Um, let's talk about the future of Noodle, of Noodle Katakotiri, Katakotiri, ah, oh, okay, so this is, like, about weight loss, right? Yes, okay, about weight loss, getting healthier, 
I understand. There was the images of him getting the burger and saying no. I don't know, dude. I'm subscribing to Maximum the Hormone. One of my favorite bands. I dig that, dug that track. Uh, like It was chaotic, messy. Uh, felt like System of a Down at points. Other times, just some of the fastest punk rock. Plus a, a, a lot of metal as well. Heavy stuff. I really dug the high screaming vocals as well as uh, like the dancey poppy parts. Like what a wild trip. Maximum the hormone is like, what is that? What does that even mean, dude? Maximum the hormone from Japan. Japan's finest rock, dude. So thank you so much, Dragonfly. Really appreciate you.